Hi, my name is Ricky Wynn, and I'm a senior application engineer at Hawkridge Systems. And today we're going to be discussing a new pack and go enhancement in SolidWorks 2018. We'll see how we now have an option to include suppressed components in our pack and go. First, a little background. If you've never used pack and go before, we can find it under File, Pack and Go. And what's Pack and Go going to do is um, say you need to send these files to somebody, it's going to grab all the reference files you need to open them up. You can add prefixes. You can also add suffixes too, as well to the, the name to the end of the uh, file names. Now, say you have an assembly with several components and you want to send most of them, a majority of them, but say there's some that you don't want to include, like for example, um, like the batteries here in this case. And we'll have several components here, about 14. So you'll see it says not open. And basically, not open means that we have them suppressed in the assembly. So if you take a look here on the base, you'll see that the batteries here are suppressed. So going back to our pack and go, you can see that we can uncheck um, any of the components that are suppressed or we don't want to include. But if you have a lot of them, you can see that it's going to be quite um, time consuming to go through every single one of them, right? So in 2017, that's the default behavior that they're included. Now in 2018, we now have an option on whether you want those components, the suppressed components, to be included. It's all going to be under a checkbox, as you can see here, to include suppressed components. So just by simply doing that, what that means for the engineer is that if you want to send over just certain parts of the assembly, but none of the suppressed components, you now have that option. You don't have to go through every single one of the parts to check or uncheck and figure out which ones you want to include. So in today's video, we covered one of the newest enhancements to the beloved pack and go feature, along with the option to include or exclude drawings, simulation results, toolbox components, decals, appearances, and scenes. We can now choose whether to include suppressed components in our pack and go. It's now as simple as just unchecking a box. Thanks for watching.